race to the moon and India does not want to be left behind. ISRO's Chandrayaan-3 is all set to make a soft landing on the moon. But why are we going to the moon in the first place? And what will we even do there? India has been exploring the lunar world for over a decade. It all began with Chandrayaan, which eventually ended up finding water on the moon. There was a brief pause due to the partial failure of Chandrayaan-2. But now with Chandrayaan-3, we hope to land on the moon once and for all. And we have a lot to do there. The mission's Chandra Surface Thermophysical Experiment, or CHAST, will measure the thermal conductivity and temperature. In simpler terms, we'll understand how fast or how slow the Moon conducts heat from its one side to the other. The Instrument for Lunar Seismic Activity, or ILSA, will measure the seismicity around the landing site. Seismic waves are generated when rock within the crust breaks, producing tremendous amount of energy, similar to what happens during our earthquakes. So can there also be quakes on the Moon? Guess we'll have to find out. The Langwer probe will estimate the plasma density and its variations. Plasma density is the concentration of ionized gas particles. How stuffy is Moon's air exactly? Chandrayaan's 3 rover will carry out in situ chemical analysis of the lunar surface. What's beneath the Moon's surface? Gold? Minerals? We want to know it all. But this is also beyond scientific endeavors. This is a space race, and ISRO will not be left behind. There are only three countries, USA, erstwhile USSR, and China, who have gone to the moon so far. India wants to be the fourth. India is competing with China, which has approved the fourth phase of its lunar exploration program and will launch missions to the moon apart from beginning work to construct a lunar research station. The US and Europe are already planning to launch humans to the moon. With its Artemis missions, NASA has already announced the names of the four astronauts who will go into lunar orbit over half a century after the end of Apollo missions. India wants to strengthen its place in the new lunar race. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today Newsmo.